So I had a little bit of a argument, you might say, about um, upping the cost a hundred baht on my room, as opposed to the last two times I was here. And uh, they gave it to me for the 900 that I wanted, but it wasn't ready. So I had to go away for a while and I come back and they tell me they've upgraded my room. Same price. So now I have this uh, condo style room. Well, a bigger condo style room in Adelphi Suites. Very nice of them. Got a nice sofa chair, table, got a work desk over there but I didn't bring my computer with me, I wish I had if I could have uh, finished editing the uh, video I was working on, TV, you know of course it's got crockery and everything like that, um, small wardrobe here but there's another one in the bathroom, microwave, cooktop, Complimentary water, coffee, little table to sit and eat if we get food in. And then there's uh, a separate bedroom in this one that has uh, quite a bit of uh, storage space if you're going to stay here for a while. It's got an iron and an ironing board, bathrobes, another TV. And of course, a, uh, another wardrobe. A lot of space, uh, a different view this time. <laughs> a vacant block down there and surrounded by condos and hotels. Over there where you see that brownish building is Soy 4. This one down here that runs along behind those is Soy 6. Yeah, so a much better room this time for the same price. Because I jacked up a little bit on the girl that said it was uh, 9,999 when I've been paying 900. And so they've uh, upgraded my room, equally as good as the previous room, just a little bit bigger. Really nice clean shower, nice clean bathroom, has a bath. Of course I won't be using the bath. Yeah, so a much better deal all around this time. I'm uh, quite happy with that. I was just wondering why the aircon wasn't working. I forgot to put my card in the slot. Yeah, so very nice. I'm going to have a little relax now. I've had something to eat. And a little bit tired from the bus trip and walking around. Yeah, so Adelphi Suites. Once again, I'll put the information for Adelphi Suites in... Uh, the information under this video, which will be Bangkok number three, this video, depending what I'm doing. I'm not sure I'll do a video over YouTube or not. Okay, so that's Hi, it. Everybody. So this morning I'm at Nakon Khan Khan Botanical Gardens. An interesting little journey to the very outskirts of Bangkok. It's a rural area and they have these botanical gardens here and I think there's a little museum and something else. So going to spend a little bit of time walking around here and showing you the place. So I hope you enjoy. Welcome back to Thailand Dreaming. Love letters from retirement. Okay, let's get on with hey. it. So this is the uh, botanical gardens that we've come to today. It's quite a pleasant walk around this place, really beautiful. It's uh, like having an easy walk in the jungle. And it's a beautiful green area, just on the outskirts of Bangkok. Really, really quite nice. A very, very pretty place. And as I said, it's uh, if you want to see some jungle, but you don't want to go trekking up in the mountains or somewhere like that. And you come to this place and the paths and the walk around the place is uh, just absolutely beautiful. And it's just like an easy walk in the jungle. Yeah. So yeah, we'll uh, do some information about it and how to get here in the information section under the video.
not so sure what the sound's going to be like. I'm only using the iPhone. I'm not using a mic. This is uh, where we came in over there. And there are some facilities there. Uh, the toilet facility is very clean, very good. Not a bad place. It cost me uh, 500 baht, which is about $23 or something Australian. Uh, for a private uh, taxi out here and to wait for us and take us back into Bangkok later on. Yeah, so we're going to have a look around here today and I really hope you enjoy it. I'll uh, start doing some video of it very shortly. Just sitting down having a drink of water at the moment. Okay, so we're going to start our little walk around the uh, Botanical Gardens. Here we have uh, the lake. You can feed the fish in there. We didn't buy any fish food, so I'm not going to feed fish. Cereal rubbish. Yeah, so looks a nice little place. It's very quiet. I can hear the drone of the city off in the background, so we're not too far away. Took us about an hour to get here. But yeah, it looks a nice little work. You can hire push bikes, but I didn't really feel like riding a push bike around trying to shoot video. Yeah. So we'll see what's going on in here. Hopefully somewhere along the line we'll see a map. Oh, there's one just up the road here. So we'll have a look at that. See where we're gonna go to. I'm not going to do too much talking because I know you don't want to listen to me drone on but I'll put some music to this later on when I get it in the editing suite. I much prefer shooting this sort of stuff in these sort of places than uh, the bars or Pattaya, 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 Pattaya. Everyone, there's a, so many thousands of YouTube videos about Pattaya. Unsung heroes of Thailand, the people that keep the parks and botanical gardens and everything beautiful for everyone to look at. Swadikab. Place in Thai. 
Because if you have uh, Thai wives or girlfriends, I can let you know there's no end of this place here. Facilities area. You can see there's uh, push, push bikes here. Irrigation. Oh, yeah. Good for green the green. irrigation system for the nursery, and I dare say for a food for a lot of the people that work here and live in here. Is there such a thing as a comfortable jungle walk? Because that's what this is. It's like being in the jungle in the middle of the city. It's beautiful. People live here. Shot of the flower of this plant, and this particular one, it looks like a hand holding a ball. It's really amazing. Look at that. Apparently, you can do something with them to eat them, and uh, really nice. They tell me. So this is. Yeah, oh, look at all the bees. They like it. A lot of bees in there getting pollen from this one too. So this particular palm, that's the flower from on it. And if you notice, the bees are just going crazy on the pollen. Just got his head out, probably hanging to eat a few flies or a couple of bees or something. Yeah. So there is lots of critters here, squirrels, birds. Hello. Bye now. Bye
the uh, bird watching tower. I'm not actually going up there now. I'm not a fantastic bird watcher. I haven't got the patience to sit around and just run the battery down waiting for birds to show up. But that's the bird watching tower for those of you that are keen on uh, bird watching. You can go up in there. And there's a huge variety of birds actually in the park here. Yeah.